What's up, everybody? Welcome to the channel where we talk about music licensing, music production, and music business. If you love any of the previously mentioned, be sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date on all my latest content. Today, I'm going to show you guys um, an easy way to create multiple sign, uh, not sign, time signatures in Logic Pro. Uh, so let's dig into it. I got a fresh session open. Uh, so with this window here, you're going to want to click um, this little show slash high global tracks button right here. And then that'll pull down the arrangement marker, signature and tempo. Um, so now what you want to do is go to signature. As you can see, I have um, four, four um, and, and the key is C right now. So to add a different signature, let's say after eight bars, I want to change it. We'll hit the plus button, create signature here. And then let's change it to say we want to do three, four. Hit OK. Then that creates a, a three, four. So then we'll go to 16. Just move your cursor to 16. And let's create uh, let's create like a I don't know, like a six, eight. So we'll do six. Change that to eight, six over eight, press OK. Now you have six over eight. So now we have um, three different signatures here. And if you want to edit them, you can just double click and it'll pop up so you can kind of edit, you know, where you want it to go. And then once you go through and play them, as soon as it hits this section, the eighth bar, the timing will change for three, four or for six, eight or whatever you set the time signature to. So that's an easy way to create multiple sign times. I keep saying sign time signatures in Logic Pro. I've had uh, I produced a song where there were multiple time signatures and this came in handy because, you know, obviously trying to keep track of that and keep everything on a grid you know, with time signatures changing throughout the song can be difficult, but this makes it really easy. Um, you can you can see exactly where it's gonna change and it just makes everybody's life easier, especially the engineer and you as the producer or whatever your role is in creating the record. Uh, so hopefully this video helped. If it did, please like, share and subscribe and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.